Hey y'all, I Rick Sky here, and I've got some very, and I mean extremely exciting news for all my Phantom 3 fans out there. And this is, this is a, it's, it's likely going to happen, but it's likely going to be Monday. And what's likely going to happen is that on the Phantom 3, we're going to see follow me functionality. We're going to see point of interest, you know, when you're filming and you want it to, you want the camera to stay fixed on an object on the ground. And we're going to see, uh, let's see, follow me, point of interest, waypoint and possibly some other enhancements as part of a uh, firmware update that is expected to release on Monday. So, you know, bear in mind, me being full-time YouTube now, as soon as I get mine updated, as soon as I get my Phantom 3 Professional updated, and by the way, the update should be applicable to, uh, to all the Phantom 3 models, but as soon as I get my Phantom 3 Professional updated, I'm going to hit the field, I'm going to field test it, we're going to orbit around an object, see how that works. We're going to do the follow me. We're going to do the waypoint. And we're going to see in the field how it all functions. And something else that's rumored to uh, possibly occur with this update that's expected to release on Monday is the Phantom 3 Advance. So if you're a Phantom 3 Ad Advanced owner, that's the 1080p camera Phantom, it's rumored that it may, and again, rumor, it may upgrade that camera with software from 1080p to 2.7k and you know you've heard me talk earlier if you've watched my other video about the Phantom 3 standard they came out with it and it was uh, basically a um, a spec down version of the Phantom 3 advanced because it doesn't have the uh, it doesn't have the same controller it doesn't have light bridge it doesn't have the vision sensors and the list goes on but it did have a 2.7k camera everybody's like oh man that's a reason to buy it because DJI was really marketing it, oh, it's got 2.7K, but you don't get that in advanced. And if you want 2.7K or better, then you know you would have to go up to the Pro. But if they update, if the firmware update that's expected to release on Monday updates the advanced camera from 1080p to 2.7K, that's really going to make that's going to really make that Phantom 3 standard just a really budget entry level option. Which there's nothing wrong with it. But if you if you've started if you used a uh, if you use the Phantom 2 Vision Plus previously like I did, it worked well. Got a ton of great videos out of that. But the interface wasn't as robust as what I get with my Phantom 3 Professional that has the light bridge. So for that reason, and a lot of people are like, man, 2.7K. Well, if you film natively in 1080p, yeah, with 2.7K, it's a bigger canvas that you got. So think 2.7K, think 1080p. So yeah, if you're filming natively in 2.7K, then you go into post, you could uh, do some zoom in and stuff and still meet or exceed that 1080p quality for your project. So from that perspective, 2.7K could be beneficial. It's of no value to me because I film everything in 4K. So for me, I would have to have an upgrade from 4K to benefit me if I wanted to do the, uh, the zooming in and post. But it's going to be an exciting week. It's going to be an exciting Monday. And I really can't wait to, uh, to get my hands on the update if it does release as expected. Can't wait to field test. And you're going to see it all here first on 400orbelow.com. So go to 400orbelow.com. I've got all the drones there, the Phantom 3, uh, the base model, which is Phantom 3 Standard, the Phantom 3 Advanced, Phantom 3 Professional, Case, accessories, quick disconnect prop guards. If you can't find it there, uh, drop me a message by way of facebook.com forward slash irixguy, and I'll be happy to try to find whatever you're looking for. And uh, most importantly, stay tuned, because I will be thoroughly field testing all of this new goodness that's about to hit the Phantom 3 camp. So I'm excited, and I hope you're excited. And subscribe if you haven't already. It's youtube.com forward slash irixguy. And be sure to fly safely and check out the drone evangelist if you haven't too. He's the uh, he's the guy that uh, that really preaches drone safety. Y'all have a good day.